From Holiday What TV, I celebrate holidays all the days on YouTube. For example, yesterday was National Peanut Butter and Jelly Day. Yeah. Who loves peanut butter and jelly? Yes. Anyone have a favorite combination of the PB&J? Anyone tell me PB&J favorite combination? Slap and tickle. Slap, Slap and tickle. I don't know this. Tell me, what, <laughs> what is this? Down the beat. It's a PB&J bacon. Bacon and Yeah. I gotta try this. It sounds good. You guys, I think it's very sad that many of our schools today are banning peanut butter because like one out of 5,000 kids might die from it. I think it's wrong. I say so what? Let's not deprive the kids of the one protein they actually enjoy. Who here has a dog? Anyone? Yeah? Yeah? Do you pick up after your dogs? Yeah. Yes? Well, this week, the first week of April, is International Pooper Scooper Week. Yes! It actually really, really is. Interestingly, a holiday that might coincide, April, is Irritable Bowel Syndrome Awareness Month. It really is, yes, yes. So it could be handy for you, it might be wise if you have IBS, to keep the pooper scooper by your side at all times. I'm just saying, you're welcome, it's my advice for the day. Yes, okay, so getting on to serious business here, or some semi-serious business. Uh, April is uh, World Habitat Awareness Month. And according to dictionary.com, I looked this up and I memorized it. Habitat is the place in which a person, group, class is normally found. One might say that is where the local might reside. For example, for us, our habitat is downtown Las Vegas. Yeah. Am I right? Yes. Well, this guy, this guy right here, by the way, responsible for your free beer. Yes, yes, yes. He's all about the locals all around the world. He has this amazing company. I want to hear about it. Tell them the genesis of Global Yodel. Sure. So um, there's nothing I love more than to travel. Um, and when I couldn't physically be traveling, I would read about travel. But I noticed something kind of odd about the way the uh, travel media looked at place. Um, a travel magazine might send a uh, journalist from San Francisco to Paris to do a feature story. But we were often let down by that type of content uh, because it takes years to really get to know a place. And someone visiting for a week can't really understand the true culture and essence um, of a place and all the, the great places to eat and where to spend a perfect day. Right. So because of that, I decided to start Global Yodel, which is a website that um, looks at the world in an innovative and artful way. I like the innovative, speaking of which, April 13th happens to be International Creativity and Innovation Day. And you're all about that. What makes Global Yodel innovative? So Global Yodel is a platform for locals around the world to share the place they live. Um, and it's also a resource for anyone interested to get thousands of little windows into what life is like mm. around the world. Mm -hmm. Oh, just by the way, everybody, uh, Global Yodel. Try to say it two times fast, it's not easy. With me on the count of three. Here we go, Global Yodel. One, two, three. Global Yodel, Global Yodel. No, you can't do it. It's not possible. It's easy? Too easy. No. I want to hear you do it by yourself. Go. Global Yodel, Global Yodel. All right, that was good. That was good. All right. So, uh, Jesse, please uh, tell us, um, if we want to put up pictures on, on Global Yodel, what's the criteria, what's the process? Sure, it's, it's really easy. You just go to globalyodel.com and hit the contribute button. Um, from there, you can upload a photograph, a piece of design, or a video. And then we have um, some custom interview questions for you to answer that are specific to the place you live. Mm -hmm. I love it, and it's, I've been on the site, and it's truly like art. You, you, the pictures that you guys allow up on there are just, yeah. which April uh, 15th is World Art Day, which I think coincides well. I heard, heard someone go, tss, <laughs> <laughs> that was you? What's your name? <laughs> no, that's your name, is no? <laughs> these, are, these are real holidays, and I'm serious about them, okay? <laughs> but I still love you, so okay, yes. Um, so, World Art Day, April 15th, it's not just tax day. Um, tell them, because you guys don't just allow any picture up on there. Yeah, so we, we want the website to be a place where you can come and get really inspired about the world. You know, the world's a beautiful place. There's so many amazing places and cultures around the world. So, we try to uh, publish, like, 
really great, beautiful, inspiring photography. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Now you're doing something, he's doing something super cool just for us in downtown Vegas. And I think this is a great brainchild in form. Um, we would like to invite all of you locals who live here in downtown Las Vegas to submit a yodel um, to our website. Um, it's a great way to promote the city you live in. We don't have any yodels from Las Vegas, so I think it would be really cool. And we're going to publish the best ones um, over the next few weeks. And our favorite, we're going to, um, our favorite yodel will win a, a big, beautiful limited edition print from the website. So. How awesome is that? That's really cool. Yes. So guys gotta help with that. We gotta, we gotta represent downtown Vegas on Global Yodel. We yes. Need, we, we need to be on there. Yes. Yes. Well, Jesse, thank you so much. Don't Thanks forget. For having me. Do the Global Yodel for this guy and happy holidays.